Hey guys, Rich with Rich Rebuilds here, and yes, I've taken on another project, but the only difference is I'll be finishing this one. Yes, I'm going to finish an actual project. Crazy, right? This is going to be a fun one, guys and girls, so hit that subscribe button so you know when another episode hits. Now, my buddy Lee and I occasionally browse the internet for silly things to buy, and we've been sending each other some crazy weird things, and little known fact is that the rat rod that I purchased last month is something that Lee found on the internet. Now, a few weeks ago, Lee sent me a link to a cryptic listing of a vehicle that just said electric car. He said, let's buy it and do some cool stuff with it. And I'm like, say no more, Lee. You had me at electric car. So Lee and I have brought out our homemade Tesla trailer, hooked it up to my Tacoma and took the hour drive to get this quote unquote electric car. And we finally got to the person's house and they had a lot of cool projects laying around. They had an electric oversized wheelchair with the ball hitch that they used to pull trails around and a crazy Ford Rat raw with air suspension. But here's the actual thing that we came to see. A Disney Princess Parade car. Broadway play. So I, I don't know at what point in the play you would you would pull the uh, this lever. And when you, I, I mean, I could do it, but then it's a whole thing to put it all back. But when you pull the lever, the headlights fall over. The, um, oh. the grill opens up. Oh, so it makes it look. That's like what all those controls are for down there. Yeah. It bro it breaks it makes it look like it fell apart. Yeah, and then there's a motor that um, turns a disc to like shoot sparks. It's kind of like a lot of weird stuff. Oh going yeah, on. okay, yep. Oh, this isn't this thing's official then. Yeah, it was kind of like um, yeah, a big contraption. And they even put a mirror over there. So you can rewire everything. Yeah. You don't really. It's once you do it once, there's no real. Um, it's not hard to put back, but this is pulling cool, in the man. steering wheel, like kind of pops off. But that's ah. that. Just it's freaking awesome. Yeah, just little things they did. In case someone tries to steal it, you know. No, 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 yeah, no, <laughs> no. It makes it look like when uh, I can't remember the. I haven't seen that video in a long time. Mr. Toad's Adventure. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, some. Oh, there's more batteries than I thought. There's six. Yeah, it's 36 volts. So. Gotcha. Uh, okay. Double yeah. hinged. Yeah. You got awesome. a free toothbrush in there too. So oh man, good. that's awesome, man. You know, I like toothbrushes. Sit there, clean out the terminals, and clean your teeth. I know. Extra whitening. <laughs> if you hurt yourself, man. Oh shit, look at that. And watch that steering wheel won't fall off on. Oh yeah. Wait, speaking of that, I think it is. Oh no. It's, it's turning. There he goes, antique. You gonna post any of this? Yeah. Definitely. So that thing does fit it, hopefully. Yeah. We'll find out. We bought boards. Yeah, it's a tilt trailer and everything like that. So. Yeah. All right, let's get the uh, boards out. All right. You know, hey, before you go, well, you, all right, yeah, you'll just put the brake on, but have like something to tie them off. No, we'll just let them roll back into the, you know, the telephone poles and be even better. Right. No. <laughs> How am I on the wheels? You look good. You look somewhat good. You're good. You're a little out, but go. You're, you're safe. Yeah, you're good. Fork. You're good. Fork action, huh? Huh? Okay, slow down. You're good, 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 good. Get a little bit more. Right there. Just hold it right there. Okay. Yeah, she fit. Wow. Holy crap. I think it was going to fit. Sweet, huh? What a contraption. I know. <laughs> Old to new. This is freaking awesome. Oh, just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> right. We'll just wrap her down. All right. We're almost off the front, so I wouldn't go too far forward. Yeah, this is not something you throw around in a corner like a golf cart. Right. Probably not. And there's room to spare on the width, too. I had no idea it would be this narrow. This is the coolest thing ever. I almost wish we had the trailer dislodged so we could see if this thing could pull it. You think it could? I think oh, it could. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yep, Rich and Lee. Just something else to add to their little collection. As you know, boys and their toys. Here we go. Say hi, Rich. Hello, hello, hello. Victoria, thank you for providing your uh, hilarious commentary. 
<laughs> she looks like a daisy. Yeah, kind of. Yeah, I think that, that'd be a good one. I like these motorcycle tires. It's she good. totally looks like a daisy. So we finally get it back to Lee's place. The Tesla trailer did very well for his first voyage. And the first thing we decided to do was change out the batteries. This baby EV had a total of six six volt golf cart batteries. Each one weighed in at 50 pounds each. We removed that old setup and ended up installing three 12 volt batteries. And we ended up saving over 150 pounds. So it should accelerate a bit quicker now. And what's the first thing you should do after you upgrade your car? Bring it to a car show, of course. Lee managed to tow the Tesla trailer with Daisy on the back of his Audi A4, and we brought it to an EV event at a local high school. I think it'd be fine. Yeah, no, it let's will. see. Let's see how good the suspension is. There you go. Awesome. And then it's gonna hit the. That was perfect. So you just got. Oh, we need more yeah, batteries yeah. in this thing. Actually, I believe many years ago, three years ago. Yeah, but, um, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. This was really, uh, so these are like marine batteries? Oh, deep, huh? deep cycle uh, deep tractor cycle. trailer tire. Uh, oh, well, tractor tractor batteries? Okay. Yep. There's, oh, it's a one wheel. There's an intrinsic oh, beauty in one sense. Oh, they were uh, trying to practice on the grass with it. Someone didn't want to crack their head open. Yeah. And I gotta say, there were Volkswagen e-golfs there, electric RAV4s, a Model 3, a Model S, and an electric motorcycle. I even brought my one wheel there for people to ride on, but I'll tell you, everyone kept coming back to Daisy. She's quite the head turner. Dude, your helmet's awesome. Dad, I'm going back there. Wait a second, let's, let's not try to hit Lee when we back up. Beep, 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 beep. No, we're not going backwards anymore. <laughs> Ready? And my daughter, she absolutely loves it. I hope you guys like this new project of mine. You know I can't leave well enough alone. I want this thing to be faster. So things are going to get really going and turned up a notch once I get rid of those old lead acid batteries. In the next episode, we'll be seeing what happens when you reduce the weight even further with Tesla batteries and push 48 volts through this little electric motor. After that, things will be leveled up even more when we upgrade the tiny 36 volt motor to a small Tesla drive unit and add even more batteries. Things are gonna get pretty interesting, so stay tuned and subscribe to see the following episode next week. I will see you guys soon.